Hey everyone, welcome to Cricut Time. If you like this video, subscribe for more project ideas and tutorials on all things Cricut. Hey everyone, if you watch this channel, then you are probably like me and love finding good deals at the craft store. Today we're going to switch it up a bit from the usual Cricut tutorials because I have a Michael's mystery box to open and share with you. I had heard about these boxes, but I came across them for the first time last weekend. Michael sells these from time to time with items that sat on the shelf for a while at 90% off. Instead of sending them back, the individual stores box them up in these big mystery boxes. Let's open up this one and see what's inside. Let's jump right in. The first thing in this mystery box is this Ashland potted poinsettia. I'm not sure yet if I'll keep it as a whole plant or snip off the flowers and use them in a wreath or a craft at Christmas. This is the one I'm excited for. When I was at the store, I could kind of see this wood farm fresh shine through a crack in the box and I knew this box was coming home with me. The next thing from the box is this wood scene craft kit from Createology. This is cute. You can color it and then set up a whole winter scene. There is another Createology wood scene set, and this one is a train. Ooh, I like this one. If you watch this channel, then you probably use a lot of ribbon at Christmas time, just like me. This one is a perfect Christmas red, and it's a big 80 foot long roll. Next up is this red, green, and brown Christmas tinsel paper. There is another Createology craft kit. This one is a 3D post office that you paint, and it has a countdown to Christmas. If we put them all up, we'll have a whole scene with all three of these kits. Next are these fun little I Love You Valentine's cookie cutters. I did get this same one in my last box, so this is officially the only duplicate I have found so far. Back to Christmas, we have this cute little potted mistletoe decoration. Next is another Createology kit. This one is a sewing stocking craft kit where you can sew your own stocking and then decorate it. There are a few more cookie cutters that were loose in the box. We have an ornament, a snowman, and a snowflake. Oh, here's a Pez, in case you get hungry when you're crafting. I did get one of these in the last box as well, but it wasn't exactly the same as this one. There are a few pine and garland decorations. This one has an H, this one is by itself, and this one looks like it probably used to have something on top, but it must have fallen off at some point. Next, we have some gold foliage and these three gold ribbons. I like that they're all in the same color and I can always find project to add decorations like this to. Well, there you have it. This is everything that came in my mystery box from Michaels. It definitely had a Christmas theme, which I was a little surprised to still find in March, but there were a few Valentine's things in there as well. I don't know about you, but I buy ribbon like this all the time. For the price of one roll of ribbon, I would have well paid for this box many times over. So not only do I get this huge roll of ribbon for an amazing price, but I got all of this stuff as well. I think it's definitely worth it for me in the future to grab one of these boxes when I see them again. When I was at the store, I wasn't sure if I should buy two boxes because I thought there would be a lot of duplicates, but the only ones I actually ended up with were the Valentine's cookie cutters. Well, thanks for watching. I hope you liked this video. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe for project ideas and Cricut tutorials.